Hi, I'm Hiroki Kuro, and welcome to Vancouver Startups YouTube channel. In this channel, I'll be talking about what is going on in Vancouver Startup Sea. If you're interested in such information, please subscribe so you don't miss out on any future videos. So today, I'm going to talk about myself. Basically, I'm going to talk about three things. Uh, first, about my background. Second, about my reason why I'm here in Vancouver. And third, about what I'm doing uh, in my startup. So first thing uh, about my background, I'm originally born in Ottawa, Ontario. I moved into Japan uh, when I was 10 years old. Uh, fast forward, after graduating grad school in Tokyo Institute of Technology, uh, majoring in fluid dynamics engineering, I joined IBM Japan. I worked there for eight years as a project manager, uh, working in financial institutes, banks, and credit card companies. I wanted to get an MBA, so I went to INSEAD got my MBA and then worked in a consulting firm for about a year and a half. After finishing consulting, I thought, okay, I want to start a business, so let me go into the startup world. Uh, I joined a few companies, uh, including a company called Locondo, uh, which is a copy of Zappos. So after that, uh, working with a few startups, I decided to start my own company back in 2011, which is called Marybase, which I currently run remotely uh, from Vancouver. So second, um, the reason why I've moved to Vancouver. It's a combination of reasons, uh, but in addition to searching for tech talent uh, in other countries, uh, we as a family had a need I finally wanted to explore education options uh, outside of Japan. So education in Japan, uh, I think this is kind of typical in Asia, but uh, they teach you more about being obedient and try to mold you into this personality versus uh, focusing more on your personal development talent, I thought would be more interesting and important for my kids. So that's the reason why we chose a Canadian education versus Japan and we thought that it would be a good option to move to uh, to move to Canada although it's COVID and it's kind of hard to like move around in general we decided made this leap and we're here happy in Vancouver so about Marybiz uh, my company so I'm a founder of this startup in Japan that is called Marybiz uh, I love this company so I'm gonna explain a little bit about what it does so Marybiz is a back office service company that serves uh, hundreds of enterprises in Japan. The unique thing about Marybiz is that 90% of the working force are women. Uh, we didn't, like, we're not eliminating male, like men, uh, but it just happens to be so. Um, we create virtual teams that support each operation of the enterprise, and like working virtually, remotely, uh, seems to work very well with women, like typically like mothers who are raising kids. So we have more than a thousand remote staff, uh, mainly in Japan, but all over the world. And they're working really well and supporting our service. We really appreciate uh, their work. And we're growing that number. I think we're about a thousand and a hundred uh, end of 2021. And we're adding more uh, staff as we go. The great thing about Marybiz, as kind of the, the name of Marybiz suggests, is that we want to create business merry, like happy. Uh, we support enterprises so that they can focus on their main business while also helping professionals uh, who otherwise can't work in a nine to five, like working hours in an office because they have kids they have to raise, maybe because they're in a rural area that they don't really have that opportunity, uh, a lot of reasons, but we want to like help people really develop their career, work on what they really love to do, and help uh, enterprises work on what their core is. Like, everybody has their strength, everybody has what they really want to do, they're passionate about that, so we want to empower everybody uh, on that sense. So Mary Biz has this kind of vision of creating a world that everybody can leverage on their talent, skills, and do what they want to do. So Mary Biz was founded in 2011. Uh, I've been running it about 10 years right now and currently uh, thanks to the management team back in Japan I've been managing it remotely in Vancouver. Um, we're doubling revenue every year and uh, we're doing fantastic. Uh, so if anybody's interested in the company uh, please let me know. 
So that's a bit about myself. Uh, I hope it kind of explains why I'm doing this YouTube channel, uh, why I'm interested in startups, and why I'm interested in Vancouver startups.、Uh, if this channel is any interest to you, if you're interested in Vancouver startups or like interested in moving to Vancouver,、uh, please subscribe. That will really help. Also,、uh, please、uh, click the like button. That will really help. It won't cost you anything, and it really encourages me、uh, for future videos. So that's it for today.、Uh, see you next time.